Martin Rodbull December 1, 1925 to December 7, 1998, was an American biochemist and molecular endocrinologist who is best known for his discovery of G proteins. He shared the 1994 Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine with Alfred G. Gilman for their discovery of G proteins and the role of these proteins in signal transduction in cells. According to a plaque posted in Silver Spring, Maryland, Dr. Martin Rodbull was a Nobel laureate in medicine for discovering that cells were like computer chips. Topic: <inaudible> Biography. <inaudible> Rodbull was born in Baltimore, Maryland, the son of Shirley May Abrams and Milton Rodbull, a grocer. His family was Jewish. After graduating from the Baltimore City College High School, he entered Johns Hopkins University in 1943, with interests in biology and French existential literature. In 1944, his studies were interrupted by his military service as a U.S. Navy radio operator during World War II. He returned to Hopkins in 1946 and received his B.S. in biology in 1949. In 1950, he married Barbara Charlotte Letterman, a former friend of the legendary diarist Anne Frank, with whom he had four children. Rodbull received his Ph.D. in biochemistry at the University of Washington in 1954. He did postdoctoral work at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign from 1954 to 1956. In 1956, Rodbull accepted a position as a research biochemist at the National Heart Institute, part of the National Institutes of Health, in Bethesda, Maryland. In 1985, Rodbull became scientific director of the NIH's National Institute of Environmental Health Sciences in Research Triangle Park, North Carolina where he worked until his retirement in 1994. He was also adjunct professor of cell biology at Duke University from 1991 to 1998 and adjunct professor of pharmacology at the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. He died in Chapel Hill of multiple organ failure after an extended illness. Topic: Research Reflecting the increasingly common analogies between computer science and biology in the 1960s, Rodbull believed that the fundamental information processing systems of both computers and biological organisms were similar. He asserted that individual cells were analogous to cybernetic systems made up of three distinct molecular components, discriminators, transducers, and amplifiers otherwise known as effectors. The discriminator, or cell receptor, receives information from outside the cell, a cell transducer processes this information across the cell membrane, and the amplifier intensifies these signals to initiate reactions within the cell or to transmit information to other cells. In December 1969 and early January 1970, Rodbull was working with a laboratory team that studied the effect of the hormone glucagon on a rat liver membrane receptor the cellular discriminator that receives outside signals. Rodbull discovered that ATP adenosine triphosphate could reverse the binding action of glucagon to the cell receptor and thus dissociate the glucagon from the cell altogether. He then noted that traces of GTP guanosine triphosphate could reverse the binding process almost 1,000 times faster than ATP. Rodbull deduced that GTP was probably the active biological factor in dissociating glucagon from the cell's receptor, and that GTP had been present as an impurity in his earlier experiments with ATP. This GTP, he found, stimulated the activity in the guanine nucleotide protein later called the G protein, which, in turn, produced profound metabolic effects in the cell. This activation of the G protein, Rodbull postulated, was the second messenger process that Earl W. Sutherland had theorized. In the language of signal transduction, the G protein, activated by GTP, was the principal component of the transducer, which was the crucial link between the discriminator and the amplifier. Later, Rodbull postulated, and then provided evidence for, additional G proteins at the cell receptor that could inhibit and activate transduction, often at the same time. In other words, cellular receptors were sophisticated enough to have several different processes going on simultaneously. Topic Rodbull's personal philosophy of science He concluded his formal written Nobel lecture 7 with this poem, To my friends, thoughts from on high life on a roller coaster, oscillating from hither to yon, no respite for the iconoclast, wandering from dusk to dawn. 
Conjuring strange thoughts foreign and twice forbidden, like Prometheus unbound, this noblest climbs in vain to Andean peaks, seeking what most would proclaim insane. Why, he ponders, are there no answers to protean questions when others thinking cleanly and simply with Occam's sharp razor proclaim what seems obvious given the beam of their unerring laser? Nature, happily unfettered with philosophy, or with cunning, or with intent moves relentlessly onward or even backward with energy unspent while we mortals test and probe with twinkling machines blinking precisely at each movement, striving to unravel its irresolute randomness, its fathomless, unlimited, meaningless rush into spiraling chaos, oblivious of its multitudinous trials and errors which we pontifically believe must be unerring truth and resolution. The laugh is on those who, burdened with pretensions of truth, believe they can fathom within fifteen minutes of human existence what has transpired over eons of space and time in this universe. So, I extol the intuitions encapsulated in the folds of my mind from whence occasionally they hurtle to the forebrain and in a twinkling of a proton's discharge bring to fruition a thought, an idea born on the feathery appendages of teeming neurons wedded in a seamless synergy. Those fleeting moments are cherished as are those precious impulses imparted by the innumerable individuals who nurtured and instilled unknowingly their encrypted thoughts in mind. So, with these fanciful thoughts in mind I give praise to you, my friends, my colleagues, my soul mates, my loved ones, for letting my soul and thoughts meander hither and yonder in this attempt at philosophy and poetry. We now belong to the gods on high who praise us for our frailties and our achievements. Topic see also List of Jewish Nobel laureates Topic References Raju, T. N. June 2000. The Nobel Chronicles. 1994, Alfred G. Gilman B. 1941, and Martin Rodbull 1925-98. Lancet. England. 355 9222, 2259. Doi 10.1016 per seconds 0140-6736-05-72762-8. ISSN 0140-6736. PMID 10881927. Birnbaumer, L. March 1999. Martin Rodbull 1925-1998. Science. United States. 283 5408 1656 doi 10.1126/science.283.5408.1656 pmid 10189319 svoboda p june 1995 the nobel prize for physiology and medicine 1994 Alfred G. Gilman and Martin Rodbull The Role of GTP Binding Proteins in Signal Transfer in the Interior of Cells. C.A.'s. Lech, Sesc. Czech Republic. 134 415 7. ISSN 0008 7335. PMID 7671286. Schultz, G. March 1995. Nobel Prize 1994 for Medicine, Physiology. J. Moll. Med. Germany. 73 3, 121-2. 10.1007, BF0019823 PMID 7633948. Kurlinska, A. Frank J. Nobel Prize 1994, G. Proteins. Postepi Biochem. Poland. 41 1, 3 4. ISSN 0032-5422. PMID 7777431. Bogutsky, W. M. Nobel Prize in Physiology and Medicine in the Year 1994. Pneumonologia i Allergologia Polska. Poland. 63 2, 120 2. ISSN 0867-7077. PMID 7633362. Flawia, M. M. Nobel Prize in Medicine 1994, Martin Rodbull and Alfred Gilman. Signal Transduction. Medicina B. Aries. Argentina. 55 75-80. ISSN 0025-7680. PMID 7565041.
Bloom, H. E. December 1994. The Nobel Prize for Medicine 1994. DTSCH. Med. Washingshire. Germany. 119 51-52, 1792-5. doi, 10.1055 ISSN 0012-0472. PMID 7736935 Farfel Z December 1994 Nobel Prize winners in medicine 1994 Herfua Israel 127 12 532 1 ISSN 0017 PMID 7813930 Fred Holm, B. B., Aperia A. December 1994. The 1994 Nobel Prize, Discovery and Significance of G Proteins. Ugeskrift for Lager. Denmark, 156, 50, 7520-4. ISSN 0041-5782. PMID 7839516. Christopherson, T. December 1994. The 1994 Nobel Prize in Physiology and Medicine. Signal Transduction and G Proteins. TIDSSKR. Nor. Lagiforen. Norway. 114 30, 3562 3. ISSN 0029-2001. PMID 7825126. Lefkowitz, R. J. December 1994. Rodbull and Gilman win 1994 Nobel Prize for Physiology and Medicine. Trends Pharmacal, Sci. England, 15, 12, 442-4. DOI 10.1016/0165-6147-94-90053-1. PMID 7886813. Kranz, H. M. November 1994. The 1994 Nobel Prize for Medicine for the Discovery of G Protein. Nederlands Tidschrift voor Geneeskunde. Netherlands. 138 48, 2380-2. ISSN 0028-2162. PMID 7990983. Marks, J. October 1994. Nobel Prizes. Medicine, a Signal Award for Discovering G Proteins. Science. United States. 266 5184, 368-9. doi, 10.1126, science.7939678. PMID 7939678. Fred Holm, B. B., Aperia A. October 1994. Nature's solution of the communication problem resulted in Nobel Prize. Significance of G proteins for signal transmission in cells. Lackertidningen. Sweden. 91 3811-7. ISSN 0023-7205. PMID 7996951. Coles, H. October 1994. Nobel Honours Pursuit of G Proteins. Nature. England. 371 6498, 547. doi, 10.1038, 371547b0. PMID 7935774. Laxo, M. Wang G. Nobel Prize to a Supporter of Young Scientists. Duodecim, Lakatitilin and Ikakauskerja. Finland. 110 23-24, 2184 ISSN 0012-7183. PMID 8654237. Rodbull, M. December 1991. The Beginnings of an Endocrinologist. Endocrinology. United States. 129 6, 2807-8. doi, 10.1210, endo 129 6, 
ISSN 0013-7227. PMID 1954866. External links Nobel Prize Biography Martin Rodbull Papers 1925 National Library of Medicine Finding Aid The Martin Rodbull Papers – Profiles in Science, National Library of Medicine